Volcanoes are found throughout the planet, on the continents as well as on the ocean floor. Volcanoes are mountains or hills that form when molten material erupts from Earth's interior through the crust. Volcanoes usually form over hot spots in Earth's mantle or at places where tectonic plates diverge or converge. To diverge means to separate, while converge means to come together. During an eruption, pressure builds up inside the Earth and forces molten magma to the surface. When magma reaches the surface, it is called lava. When lava cools, it forms igneous rock. Over time, this rock builds up and creates a variety of landforms. Volcanic mountains form in different shapes and sizes. Composite volcanoes are one type of volcano. They have the most violent eruptions and can create huge mountains. Mount Rainier in the state of Washington is one example. Another type of volcano is the shield volcano. These are shaped like a bowl or a shield with long, gentle slopes and bases several miles wide. Shield volcanoes have mild eruptions but can be huge in size. A shield volcano named Mauna Loa in Hawaii is the world's largest volcano. The entire island chain of Hawaii is actually made of the tops of volcanoes that formed on the ocean floor. All of these examples are part of the volcanic mountain chain that runs around the Pacific Ocean. It goes from the tip of South America along the west coast of North America through Asia and south to New Zealand. This is known as the Ring of Fire. Volcanic eruptions can also form craters and calderas. These are large, bowl-shaped depressions made when a volcano collapses after a major eruption empties the magma chamber. An example of a caldera is the Yellowstone Caldera. A large portion of Yellowstone National Park is a caldera formed by volcanic eruptions. Sometimes craters can fill with water and form crater lakes. These can be found all over the world. Magma beneath the surface can also heat groundwater and cause geothermal features, including geysers, fumaroles, hot springs, and mud pits. Many of these places interest tourists who want to see geysers erupt or soak in the mineral-rich waters of hot springs. Destruction from volcanoes can also change surrounding land features. Material from eruptions can mix with water and cause mudslides or floods. Lava flows can destroy entire forests or communities. Volcanic eruptions have the power to destroy Earth's landscape, but they can also rebuild it in amazing ways.